Welcome to Framework Fortune Crypto and welcome back Framework Fortune community. I'm your host Ben and if you've been following the channel then you know that I have been battling to try to get in Mythic on the Play to Earn Gods Unchained TCG. It has been very rough. You guys have seen me almost make Mythic over and over again and fell short every time. Fortunately, this time I'm not on live stream. It's a little bit late at night, but we're going to dive in to this final game. As you can see behind me, as I am one game away, one win away from finally breaking into Mythic with this war deck. So let's jump in. I did pick up another Soul Survivor and made those changes that I was talking about earlier in the day in the live stream. So since I've made those changes, I have only lost one game up to this point. So I have a couple of games that I can lose, at least at least one. So I'm going against the Deception deck. Now what I've been doing is getting rid of Odie pretty early. We might keep the Eager Griffin. There we go, perfect. Want that Guild Enforcer in hand. So when we get to five mana, we can buff him, take him out. Look at you getting a little, little shiv. Martha Stewart with her shank thinks she can take me down. Is that what you think, huh? So let's play the eager griff and see if we can prevent some spells or pull out some spells or pull something out here. Okay, that's fine. Poking at me with the shiv. I'm gonna do here. Go ahead, throw that. Put him down to one health. Keeping the game nice and even. Eager Griffin's a pretty good card. I just run it as a one of, but against magic decks, this thing can come in real handy. They're going to want to get it off the field because every time your opponent casts a spell, it gives it two strength. Death decks it works with. So he just took control of it. I guess because he took control of it, it didn't get the buff because I was the opponent to the Griffin, unfortunately, on that play, but hey, that's all right. See, he's down to three cards. We got a decent advantage. What do we want to do here? I'm going to go ahead and just hit him in the face and then play the Spools of War. Get frenzied. There we go. Nice. So we got a little pig there. And I just don't want to get too crazy. And fill the whole board because we are approaching six mana. So we want to be aware of Rupture Dance. Or Rapture Dance, whatever it is. Right, it's got a little front line out there. We got some Blitz in hand. We can take that out pretty easily. Hmm. Do we want to take it out? Or do we want to drop the Guild Enforcer? Let's go ahead and take it out. <clears throat> and then we'll throw that pig there. Shrink his board because he is getting a little too many creatures out for my liking. I'm going to keep him. Keep him in check. 
Because the higher mana we get, the bigger cards we can pull out, the bigger buffs. Try to end this game. Okay, so like we got that shiv out of the way. He's gonna play a play the bull from the sanctum. It looks like. Oh nope, he didn't play it. Playing the front line instead. And we got Hector in hand now. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Let pig get rid of that. Then I'm gonna pop another man and buff him to a four attack in case he attacks with this. That'll go ahead and kill it. So next turn, right now I have one creature out. Rupture dance isn't gonna do much unless he just floods his board here. He's using his god power to hide it, so he may just try to kill me. But, ooh, I need one more turn. I thought I was going to be able to play that Soul Survivor. That's okay, though. Let's see. Let's buff him. Go ahead and take out. Yeah. And whatever he does, as long as the Guild Enforcer is still alive, he's got his own Guild Enforcer, that's absolutely fine. It doesn't matter because his Soul Survivor is going to take it out. And that's why I picked up a second one because that card has won me so many games. And probably will end up winning me this game as well. So it is still close though. 14 to 11. There's plenty of deception spells he could play to take this out. So this game is not over. Like they like that when he put it to sleep. So he's just delaying a little bit. And he pulled out a grand hall. There's my grand hall. I'm gonna go ahead and attach the claws. Well, I think, yeah, I still have to kill that. So let's pass it a turn. Let's see what he does here. I attach the claws just in case he kills the guild enforcer. I can still push some damage that he can't really stop. There we go. Stone skin poison is gonna lock him up for three turns. So. That's what I was concerned about. He's pulling out prison escapees. He's going to try to pull that shenanigans. But we ain't going to let that happen. Let's see, I do have what I got for Prince Hector here. We got Blitz Twin Strike. Blank. And he's got both of these front lines. I don't know if that's the play. Hmm. I'm running out of time. I got to make a decision here. Yeah, let's just do it. We can take both of these front lines out with Hector. <clears throat> Go at him with the claws. It's going to buff the Grand Hall. Yeah, I think that was the right call. I 
But yeah. So he also got a guild enforcer from one of those cards, but we're about to unlock here on our guild enforcer. So we just got to get rid of his. Fortunately, don't have any blitz. Let's see. If I did three with that, that would put it down to three. That would put it down to two health. Yeah, I don't have anything to take it out with. Besides him. Alright, let's drop another round here. Get his health back up some. And then I'm going to attack that. We'll take him out. Kill that prison escapee. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Faster, faster, faster. Let's get this guy down. No, get this guy down. Come on, come on. Oh, <laughs> it wouldn't let me play it in time. I tried. Oh, no. As long as he doesn't play any front line, though, I got him. Nah, that burn. Nope. He's dead. And there we go. Game is over. Looks like. Could it be? Is it possible? What is going on? Let's see. Let's see if that was enough. I'm really stretching out how epic I'm trying to make this, but I forget how long it takes to get. Look at there. What does that mean? Up. Uh, Mythic. I am now in Mythic.